Bears have played numerous roles in human history. They were vicious killers to be feared and opposed. We've worshipped them at other times. We've also captured them and forced them to perform stunts since we thought they were cute. But other from the fact that they're furry, robust, and prefer sleeping through the winter, what do we truly know about them? They can use tools. Many bears appear to be lumbering brutes due to their size, but they are actually highly intelligent. Experts believe bears are as intellectual as most gray apes, and others believe they are as intelligent as three-year-old humans. There is certainly evidence to suggest that bears are quite intelligent and may even be smarter than we previously assumed. An Alaskan brown bear was observed using tools in 2012. The bear was grooming and scratching itself with a rock in its paw. This discovery places bears among the only non-primate creatures capable of using tools. Elephants, dolphins, ravens, and whales are also members of the category, and they are all known to be intelligent animals. Bear Farms Bears are prized in several East Asian countries because the bile produced by their gallbladders is thought to have medicinal properties. Bile is said to ease interior heat, but it is also said to cure everything from hangovers to cancer. As a result, it can be found in a wide range of products, from food to shower gels. This has resulted in the bizarre and horrible practice of bear farming. Hundreds of black bears are kept in excruciatingly small cages on these farms, where the bile from their gallbladders is extracted on a daily basis. Officials have recently put pressure on bear farming to stop. Nonetheless, because bile has been utilized in Asian traditional medicine for millennia, the terrible practice is unlikely to be stopped anytime soon. Bear Brain Surgery Bears can experience medical issues that are remarkably similar to those experienced by people. One of these conditions is hydrocephalus, a dangerous disease in which liquid accumulates in the head, placing pressure on the brain. Hydrocephalus is a one-way ticket to a slow, agonizing death if left untreated. It's like having a continual, piercing migraine that gets worse and worse until you die. However, modern technology has made it possible to treat this dreadful illness in both bears and humans. Lao has recently witnessed the first bear brain surgery. Champa, a hydrocephalic Asiatic black bear, was the patient. Except for minor brain damage induced by the liquid's pressure, the bear survived the operation practically unscathed. Champa has become considerably more active after recovering from the surgery, and the embarrassment caused by the partial removal of her fur and her relief is palpable. The Largest Bear The world's largest bear is a source of contention. Most scientists agree that the polar bear, which may weigh over 1,000 kilograms and tower up to 2.44 meters, 8 feet tall, deserves the honor. However, some Kodiak bears, a brown bear subspecies, can be substantially stockier than their northern counterparts. Some specimens have stood over 3 meters, 10 feet tall, and weighed more than 1,134 kilograms. Polar bears, on the other hand, are larger on average. Even yet, one bear used to be much larger. During the Pleistocene epoch, the South American gigantic short-faced bear existed. It was 3.35 meters, 11 feet tall and weighed a hopping 1,588 kilograms. Hibernation The ability of bears to hibernate has always been a source of consternation. For a long time, the only thing we understood about the process was, well, that it occurred. Scientists were baffled as to how a big animal could load itself with food before suspending its own life functions for up to five months. Many small mammals, such as marmots and bats, had the capacity, but a bear appears to be too huge. Science eventually cracked the issue in 2011 after monitoring five bears hibernating in a controlled habitat. Until then, it was assumed that bears conserve energy mostly by lowering their body temperature. This was determined to be false as the temperature only decreased by roughly 6 degrees Celsius. Instead, the bear's body employs a variety of deceptions. Its breathing rate drops to one or two breaths per minute, and its heart beats at a pace of four beats per minute in response to each breath. A bear's body also goes through a transition stage a few weeks before and after hibernation, allowing it to function properly, but with a reduced metabolic rate. Its metabolism is only 25% during hibernation. All of this new information may one day lead to technology that allows people to hibernate as well. That's still a long way off. We don't know how their brains work with so little oxygen or how they maintain bone and muscle mass while not moving in months.